Hi, I'll be making Kodai Shutir Kachori, also known as Matar Ka Kachori. To start with, I'll take a pan and heat it and drizzle a little bit of oil. To the hot oil, I'll be adding some cumin. As soon as the cumin starts spluttering, as they're doing now, I'll add soft powder. To this, I'll be adding green peas, which I have already run in a grinder and made a paste. The reason we have to saute the green peas paste is because there's a lot of water in the peas and we have to dry it up before we do the filling of the Kodai Shutir Kachori. I'll add a little bit of ginger paste, some green chilies paste or crushed green chilies. And just before we turn off the flame, I'll add in some salt and a little bit of sugar. And we turn off the flame and let this mixture cool a little. You can transfer it to a bowl to cool. The mixture has cooled now totally, so we can start making our kachori. For that, I'll first heat some oil in a kadai, enough for deep frying. Mm, that'll be it. I have already made a dough using maida, little bit of atta, oil and salt, a soft dough. Take a small amount of this maida. Make a little cup and put this mixture. Enough. You can grease the base a little with oil. Make sure the filling doesn't come out. You have to be very careful when you're putting the filling. All the filling should be concealed. None of it should be outside. Otherwise, they will break. Yeah, and the oil is hot. I'll put them for frying. Carefully. Press it a little while frying. It cooks evenly. We have to get an even brown color. There. Drain out as much oil as possible. And try to fry one at a time because they cook better. You can see how the kachoris are turning brown and the surface is turning crisp. And also if the filling inside is even, the kachoris would be even and round. I'll be serving the kachoris with some imli chutney. That's what it's usually had with. But if you want, you can have it with some mint chutney or some vegetable if you like to. The really delicious Kodai Shutir Kachori is ready to serve.